Developing tonight, FC Cincinnati is one step closer to getting a Major League Soccer franchise. After 10 hours of deliberations, the team signed a community benefits agreement with the West End Community Council. It calls for the soccer team to partner with the community on improving the quality of life, things such as affordable housing, funds for civic and sports teams, plus community input on the stadium are all included. I think that um, the community did not get everything that it wanted. Um, and there's still a lot of work to be done for this community, but I think that we have uh, found a path forward for, for many of the issues. Yes. After the signing, a resolution supporting the CBA was approved by the Budget and Finance Committee and then the full council. FC Cincinnati will play at Gettler Stadium in about 30 minutes, and that is where Nine on Your Side's Kristen Swilly joins us live with team president Jeff Birding. Kristen. Yeah, good evening, Kristen. Of course, as you know, this has been a process, months in the making, really. And as we're standing here now, we are with Jeff Birding, president of FC Cincinnati. As people have been walking by, they've been congratulating you. Obviously, a long and at times difficult process. Talk about today's really pretty long meeting and what you all got accomplished. Well, it's been the culmination of five months of work. We want to be great neighbors in the West End. It's a neighborhood that needs investment, needs a catalyst for growth. This is a big step forward to make our MLS vision a reality. Sure. Talk about just sort of the big financial commitment you all are making in that neighborhood. Well, it's it's millions and millions of dollars, but more than that, I think it's just the spirit of partnership. It's the foundation. It's a legally binding commitment that is the foundation of a partnership that's going to be ongoing for decades on how we work together to address the concerns, the challenges in the West End. It's a neighborhood that needs some love and needs some attention. And that's not only going to be FC Cincinnati, it needs to be uh, the, the city of Cincinnati. It needs to be other neighborhood organizations. It'll be the Port Authority and all of us working together in partnership to improve the neighborhood. Absolutely. And of course, there has been a lot of concern about housing. I've been to a lot of those public meetings. Obviously, you have to uh, a lot of people just speaking out and saying, I don't want to lose my home. And you guys have really started the CBA by going into details about that. Speak to that point for me, if you could. Yes, we don't need to take anyone's home. All the properties we're acquiring are commercial properties, a lot of vacant land. Uh, everyone whose home is there, we want more people living in the West End. We want to keep all the, the longtime residents of the West End, they're going to stay in the West End. And we're going to work with the neighborhood organizations to ensure that that can happen. All right, so this was one of the last big hurdles. Talk about where we go from here. Well, we still have a few agreements that uh, have been committed to that just need to be signed. There's some lawyering that need, that's being done, if you will, behind the scenes, some with the city, some with the county, some with the Port Authority, Cincinnati Public Schools, uh, assembling our team that if, uh, if anointed, if you will, by MLS, will have the opportunity to proceed quickly. Uh, the next big step, I think, publicly is, is we want to get the MLS commissioner here and show off our neighbors in our neighborhood of the West End. Absolutely. Thank you so much, Jeff, for your Thank time. You. And again, guys, they have a game starting here shortly, so we'll go ahead and send it on back to you. But for now, reporting live, Kristen Swilly, 9 on your side.